Hey guys, welcome to the Offshoot Comics D-Pad. Sounds weird to say, doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. <laughs> this is our video game show. Uh, we're your hosts, Kirby Kidd. And Black Superman. Also known as David Clark. And Walter Bryant. And today we're talking about the Skylanders killer, Disney Infinity. Okay, now, just from what we saw, um, just in, in the trailer. Yeah. It looks awesome. Yeah. It, it looks awesome. For those of you who don't know, uh, on the 15th, they had an event at the El Capitan Theater here in L.A. where they just were like... They threw the gauntlet down, and then they just, they just punched Activision in the face. They're like, your game is no longer valid. <laughs> well, it, it, it's not going to be valid. It's still valid right now. I don't like, know. Like, sell, you, sell as much as you can right now. Yeah, yeah, I'm telling you. I'm, I'm ready to get rid of all my Skylanders. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Skylanders is an amazing game. It's where you put your little figurine onto a portal of power, which you'll probably be seeing at the bottom of the screen, and then it pops up, and then it starts doing stuff. Um, however, Disney... Is doing that except with better figurines, characters you know, a lot more characters, better graphics, more options, and multiplayer. And they're you know saying that there's a good possibility that characters we really, really, really want to see Marvel might show up in Star Wars. They're under consideration. Now they may have their own games, you know, Marvel Infinity and Star Wars Infinity, but I'd rather them all be in the same game. Dude, Darth Vader versus the Phoenix. Dude, Mickey Mouse with Darth Vader's head. With the Infinity Gauntlet and Captain America's shield, <laughs> using the Force. <laughs> Tell me the, that wouldn't be awesome. <laughs> the, the Hulk as the leader of the Black Pearl. <laughs> but dude, I would love to like like play the, like the the Little Mermaid storyline, and then and like Ursula's like, I have all the power, and, and like like the Little Prince guy's like, we have a Hulk. <laughs> He's like, dish, dish. dude, play through the Bambi storyline with Hulk. Okay, Bambi's Bambi. mom will not be shot. I refuse to see that happen again. <laughs> that was traumatic. <laughs> Disney, why would you do that to a little child? Dude, Disney has this habit of, of like killing off really cool parents. Yeah. I don't know if you ever know. Mufasa. Mufasa. Yeah, Mufasa. Uh, yeah, Mufasa. That was terrible. <laughs> you know, Cinderella's dad, he was cool. He gets in his carriage, goes away, dies. Mm. Leaves him with the horrible leaves her with the horrible stepmother. I mean, Disney, you've got a horrible you've got this this horrible track record with really cool parents, but but you're making a cool game. Dude, so, Beast. we will rectify these with Marvel characters. Give them to us. Beast versus the Hulk. Which Beast? The Beast. Oh, The Beast. The, as, the, opposed, the beast. As, as opposed to Henry McCoy. Oh, no, 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 not, no, no. Because, no. yeah, that's not a, that's not a good no, fight. No, it's not, no, it's not. That's no. really not. Like, The Beast from Beauty and the Beast. Oh, okay. Well, that's not actually a good fight either, because Gaston <laughs> almost killed him with a knife. Yeah, but, see, if you played Kingdom Hearts, you realize the Beast actually has some skills. By the way, Kingdom Hearts, we hope is in. Yeah, I'd like to see Link. Link? Link. I love Link. From Nintendo? Yeah. He's not Disney. I know that. Why would he be in the game? Why shouldn't he be in the game? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure Disney will buy. Uh, <laughs> yeah, they'll, they'll, they'll probably buy N Nintendo eventually. Yeah, but, but, no, okay, but you know, there may be some actual Nintendo characters in there because we saw at the very end of the trailer, Wreck-It Ralph made it in. And Wreck-It Ralph has Bowser, Sonic, Zangief... M. Bison, so they may be in there. Now, day one, they're launching with about 20 characters. The rumor is it may be 60. If they do that, not only do they have more than Skylanders, they have characters that you actually know. And uh, yeah, and the characters you know is actually really big, a really big thing for me. Because yeah. I mean, like the Skylanders, they're cool. I, I got my I got my kids Skylanders for Christmas. Skylanders is cool, but. I know nothing about any of these things, and really, right. honestly, until you activate them, you don't I don't really know what they do. Yeah, you know, so and. Hopefully they won't do the whole different store thing because I'm tired of going to each store to get different Skylanders. But uh, you know, well you know this, you know they're gonna do that. Like Toys R Us will always get their own special edition <laughs> I know, or something. I know. But I mean, there's so so much, so much potential they can do with this. They can make you go to Disneyland and have special things there. You can get like maybe upgrades or a special different. I'm just gonna call them Skylanders. Different Skylanders over there, <laughs> you know. Um, but. The game was really cool, and you know, I, I know a lot of people were saying it's just Disney Skylanders. No, 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 Skylanders is just Activision Infinity. <laughs> I mean, they have multiplayer. You can um, there's story modes that apparently the, the characters apparently cannot cross over to other story modes, but they all apparently come with their own story. But there's uh, the toy box where they can all interact and fight gigantic Zerg, and I mean, it just looks amazing. You can make your own world, make your own your home base. I mean, there's so many things. And, and you can fight people. 
and I believe it's multiplayer. The way the way they're making it sound, because it saying, appears to be multiplayer. Because they're saying you can meet other people and share worlds and stuff, and yeah, especially like when you, when you looked at the end of the trailer. Yeah. you know, there's like there's like giant Zerg, and then there's like four characters getting yeah. ready to take him on. Now they could just be something they did for the trailer. However, yeah. if you could do that, that'd be cool. That that trailer cool. was cool as crap, though. I mean, I watched it like four times. It was great. I mean, and so far we, we've seen Wreck It Ralph, we've seen Pirates, uh, Monsters Inc. Uh, the Incredibles, Cars, Cars made it in. Uh, yeah, I don't know about the whole Cars. Thing, Lilo but... and Stitch, The Nightmare Before Christmas, um, Phineas and Ferb. Good for you guys. Okay, look, <laughs> Phineas and Ferb. They should just they should just automatically win the game. Right. It's like where's Perry? He's in HD. That's where he is. <laughs> like, I mean, I'm I was very proud of them. Today we built a gamma bomb and we're gonna become two Hulks. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, it's cool. And they can do that. Happy <laughs> happy. Like, we built a Death Star. We own the galaxy now. <laughs> but, I mean, uh, of course, the Toy Story's in. Because the game started out as a Toy Story game. They're like, why end it there? And you know what? They were right. You were right. I mean, they made the toys. They're like, because these will look cool on my shelf. And that is the way to approach making games. <laughs> I think the way to approach making games is, what would I like to play? And then make And that. then make that. I mean, because obviously certain people like you know Duke Nukem Two um, or Duke, Duke, Duke Nukem Forever. That, whatever, that they, game they, they did. They didn't understand. Okay, video games have moved ahead. What like twenty years? So yeah. don't remake the game that was popular twenty years ago. And there's a bunch of other things wrong with it too. If you search for Duke Nukem Forever and Kirby Kid, you will see the reasons why I stopped playing it on YouTube. Not right now, or maybe open on the tab. <laughs> but. uh yeah, but Disney Infinity looks really amazing. I mean, my girlfriend's psyched to play the game. Everyone I've talked to is psyched to play the game. And it comes out in June, near my birthday. Uh, so hopefully uh, I'll get it in all the figurines. Hint. Other family <laughs> members are watching this. Hint. Hey, I'm look. Saying. Okay, look. I, I, I will promise you one figurine. However, <laughs> <laughs> mine's going to be the cool one. Right, exactly. <laughs> like, let, let, tell everybody else after I've bought your figurine. Get the stupid ones. Yeah, which, which, which ones to get? <laughs> Whatever one the coolest one is, that's the one. But I mean, my nephews play Skylanders, and uh, my the youngest nephew, he, nephew he's like four, and uh, his favorite thing ever is Cars. And Cars is in. Now, he was all about Skylanders. I can almost guarantee you, the moment he sees this game, Skylanders is garbage to him. Now, keep, keep in mind, I enjoyed that game. That game was really cool and revolutionary. Till two days ago. <laughs> so, I mean, just, just the graphics alone killed it. Yeah, the graphics are pretty awesome. I, I mean, mean, it's just amazing. I mean, you, like, you, you, the, the thing starts off, I mean, you watch the trailer, and you should really watch the trailer. Yeah. And it starts I'll, off. I'll have it playing down here. But, I mean, the game the game was great. The game is fun. I like the concept. I like the characters. The characters are very important. Um, and it's just, now, we hope the play is is good. You know, because each different game inside of it has, like, different ways. Like, Monsters, uh, Inc. is more about stealth and scaring people. Or Pirates is about action, you know. So I'm hoping that the game play is actually pretty good. But uh, if it lives up to the hype, this may be one of the best games of all time. And it can go for literally ever. Cause yeah, there's a lot of characters. They, have way, they haven't even touched classic Disney characters. I mean, then they have Kingdom Hearts. They have the entirety of Marvel. The entirety of Star Wars. So... But we're going, going a little too long for YouTube. There's going to be more about this on our Krypton Radio show, which will air Sundays at 5 o'clock. Um, we'll talk about more about Infinity because it's, so it's that good. It's that good. It really is that good. It's that good. Uh, so uh, check us out on Krypton Radio, Sundays at 5 o'clock. Follow us on uh, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, apparently. Yeah, pretty much anything that Any, you can think of. That anything says that is a comments, thing. Yeah, just if put an offshoot comment yeah. and when it pops up. Yeah, Click on it. If, if it's a thing, we're there. Because Offshoot Comics is us. LinkedIn, you know, whatever. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hopefully you'll have a bunch of, uh, there should be things down here that I'll show you. Also, if you notice, to this side of me, there's one of our characters. His name is Hard Drive. Um, he'll also have a comic book debuting at WonderCon. He's super awesome and destroys things. And destroying things rocks. Yeah. Uh, but until next time, you've been your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. <laughs>